to start off with the, would you like to start off with the first couple of slides? Uh, yeah. Um, so what we're first gonna talk about is uh, racism and colorism um, in API, API communities. Um, colorism is defined as the prejudicial or preferential treatment of same race people based solely on their color. Uh, and pale skin is a prominent part of the beauty standard, resulting in a large market for skin lightening products, especially in South Asia. Um, even though the caste system in India is officially outlawed, the remains of it are still felt throughout society. And in Myanmar, um, the Rohingya, Rohingya people uh, continue the discriminated, uh, to continue to be discriminated against again due to their culture, faith, and skin color. Um, view of uh, LGBTQ plus identities. Um, the stigma around discussing these identities uh, is very large and insanely common in API households and communities. Um, and it's especially seen as taboo and wrong in uh, many Asian communities. Um, originally, queer identities were more accepted in Asia, but colonialism changed the way queer people were perceived. And in many Asian countries, there exist anti LGBTQ plus laws and policies. Um, a great example of this is that same-sex couples can only get married in three Asian countries. And um, patriarchy slash sexism. So discrimination based on sex is heavily prevalent in the API community. Um, and usually women are portrayed to be worth less than men, which reinforces a sense of toxic masculinity and a sense of superiority. Uh, dehumanization of Asian American women through hypersexualization in the media is all too common. Um, this treatment towards women results in, results in gender-based violence. Uh, 41 to 61% of API women report having faced physical or sexual violence at least once by their partner. Um, there, and there is a strong connection between racism and sexism. Uh, the, in the Atlanta shooting, uh, six of the eight people killed were Asian American women. Uh, and women report hate, hate incidents 2.3 2 times more than men. Sex, sex discrimination also creates a lot of trauma in women, especially those who are young, which can result in, a poor, in poor mental health. Yeah, so I will be um, covering this slide. Um, so mental health in the, a in the API community, unfortunately, is really, really stigmatized and is a source of contention, unfortunately. And so as we can see on the graphic to the left, um, Asian Americans are three times less likely to seek mental health services and resources than other Americans. Um, and because of the, the stigma is caused by mental health problems being seen as non-existent or not really being real. And that there's this idea that if you aren't, you know, mentally healthy or you're not considered to be normal mentally, then you can't really be successful. You can't really fit in. You're not really seen as the ideal type of person. And because of the stigma as well, this prevents a lot of um, people in the API community from getting therapy or counseling or resources to help with their mental health problems. Um, and this can affect all sorts of people, you know, uh, people of the LGBTQ community, people who are, um, you know, people with disabilities, young people, and so on and so forth. And because of the stigma, a lot of people who do need help don't, aren't able to get it. Um, as part of my own experience, actually, I've had problems with mental health before. And as an API um, member, it's often been seen, yeah, it's often been seen as difficult because you get judged a lot and people look at you strangely and they think, oh, you're not normal. or Oh, you're this, you're that. And it's really not right. And hopefully that hopefully with more awareness and with advocacy, this type of stigma can be broken down and people are able to get the help that they need. Yeah, and so the next, another problem within the API community that really needs to be addressed more is problems with immigrate issues with immigration and language barriers specifically. Um, so a lot of 
a lot of later generation Asian Americans um, and other members of the API community really struggle with connecting to their cultures or connecting with their families because a lot of language barriers might be present. So maybe someone who was you know, born in the US or was born in an English speaking country and their families don't necessarily speak English as their dominant language, there can be a disconnect between what their family you know, what their family's traditions are and what they're used to seeing. Um, and this is particularly true, again, with older and younger people. Um, and this usually is a challenge for first generation immigrants, particularly because this has um, issues with this affects assimilation and being able to understand um, API specific, Asian American specific cultural issues. Um, like the idea of fitting in and the idea of being again kind of ideal and you know creating that balance between you know tradition and modernity or fitting in with uh the american community at large um and about 14 percent of all undocumented immigrants are members of the api community and unfortunately because of the stigma behind people who immigrate to the country as undocumented people, um, they live in fear of deportation, arrests, you know, coming into contact with immigration and, and customs enforcement or ICE, and losing their businesses or their homes, you know, being taken away from their families. And first generation immigrants often come from high conflict areas. Um, so areas with war or political violence or instability or poverty, those type of things. They often have a difficult time adjusting to political and social cultural due to the traumas that they experienced um, or their families experienced in those countries. And an example of this is religious intolerance in America, like Islamophobia and that type, and that type of thing. Okay, so if I don't think there's enough people necessarily for breakout rooms, so I guess we can just have our main conversation here if that's fine with everyone. And we also have some questions to go along with 